Good evening. A man has been found guilty of interfering with a marine animal after standing on the back of a whale on the far south coast. Although finding Andrew Curvin guilty, Justice Robert Torbett deferred entering a conviction or imposing a monetary penalty, Mr Curvin is expected to appeal. Wollongong Court has heard allegations a building company was forced to pay more than $330,000 to a developer to insure its part in an Illawarra Retirement Trust project. The evidence has come during an inquiry into the collapse of Nova Constructions. The state government has refused to comment on claims the Wollongong Education Department may be moved to Yass at a cost of up to 100 jobs. The silence follows suggestions the South Coast and Riverina Education Departments will amalgamate. And the Wollongong Lions look certain to make the Sydney Australian Rules competition playoffs after a big win over Hawkesbury. More news later on Wind Television.